Hi, welcome back to the channel. Today we're going to be playing Dark Stories the Workshop. You are working the night shift at your job and workshop. You get to your shift a little late, and your coworker doesn't seem to be around. Things don't seem right, and it doesn't take long to find out why. We're just hopping in. You can turn off the VHS filter. Wow, my eyeballs just got irradiated. A few years back, I was working a job in a workshop. Fixing cars. It was working the night shift, which sucked, and I had a co-worker named Gary, who was bearable. One night, I got there a little late. And Gary had died. I'll never forget what happened that night. We really like our ellipses. Hello, hello, I'm here. Wait, why is it so dark in here? Yeah, why is it so dark? Ooh, I like the color palette that we're working with. Everything is like super murky apart from the red. Hi mate, I'm not sure why, but the lights have been fucking up in here today. It's all right though, we'll have a go at the boss tomorrow, the prick. There's a torch in the office, best to take it so you don't trip and break your neck if they go out again. A torch being a flashlight in the UK. Ooh, I like it. Nothing else in here, I think. Hello. Good day, Elaine. Hello. Anyone up to no good over here? You work in a workshop. Tell me, does it look like this? You have a register. Some cars all nice and lifted up. Does this raise and lower them? Oh my god, I can't walk under the thingy. How do I get over there? Do you hear that? Do you hear that whispering over there? I think I can't do that yet. Not that I want to, because, you know, spooky. Whispering, not good for me and my health. Oh. Hello? Um, there's some spooky, scary noises. Jesus Christ, mate, there's something fucking going on. I've had to lock the door and nothing can get in. We got in. I'm just hiding the scary noises in the boxes. What's up with my vision? Interesting that it goes so blurry over there. I like the effect, but I don't understand why it's affecting. Really big vehicle there. Over here now? Oh no, over here. It's green. Well, that thing definitely knows that I'm here if it didn't already. Okay, I can open the gate by the stairs now. Fuck me, you're late tonight. I might be done at the shops or something when you read this. There is something really odd going on though. I can't tell if maybe someone has broken in while we've been off. I keep hearing noises and what sounds like talking. See if you hear it too. Speak to you later. Yeah, there's definitely some spooky noises happening over here that sound like whispering. Alright. By the stairs, huh? That's up. Oh! Hello? Ring ring? I hear you. Leave me alone. Oh, we can go in. I'm going up. Don't come get me. I'm just a little guy trying to work on some cars. Oh, it's our footsteps. My gosh. Fuck off. Come in here and I'll kill you. Shit, it's locked. The key should be downstairs by the cash register. Oh, no. Can't we call out to our friend and be like, hey. It's just us. Please don't blast me when I go in there. Probably paranoid. I would be. Ooh, 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 ooh. I'm scared. 
It's the darkness that really gets to you, you know? Oh, oh the key is here. Alright. Oh, it's so loud. Shh. Okay. I think it just turned off on its own, eh? Ooh. It's so dark and I can't see very far ahead of me. It's really good for building tension here. I hate this. Ooh. Bye. I do feel like our friend's gonna blast us open when we go through the store, though. That's unfortunate for us. Hello, friend? Are you here? Jesus Christ, Gary, I need to get the fuck out of here. What happened to you, Gary? Oh my god, your face was torn off, Gary. Our face is about to go, too. Oh, we can run. That's new. It's waiting for us? No. <gasps> oh my god, get me out of here. Oh my goodness. I don't know what that thing was, but it butchered Gary and nearly killed me. <gasps> I reported it to the police, who thought I was crazy and kept me as a suspect. Poor Gary. Gary was just out there trying to live his little life and you wrote so many thankful notes. Thankful, I mean helpful notes to us. But thankfully there was enough CCTV in the workshop to show that I couldn't have killed him. Also, there was no way I could have done that to his face. Yeah, his face got ripped off. He would have had to have been like Hannibal. I moved city shortly after that. Poor Gary. Maybe the monster was just, you know, a little hungry. Just needed a little midnight snack. Thank you for playing. This is the first game I've ever made. Wow! I know it's short and not much. It's still good. But we all start somewhere. If you have any feedback or anything, let me know on the Itch.io page. No, I think for your first game... And for it just being like a short little bite of horror, this is great. You had enough tension. Your lighting was really good. Um, I don't love games that are just, you know, go here, get this thing to progress the story. But, you know, it's it's easy to start there. So I understand why so many um, junior developers go that route. And I think this is pretty entertaining and interesting. Um, the set design is good. I like that it's laid out the way it is it makes sense for why things are in different corners and why you would have to kind of run around and get them um yeah i don't really have any notes i prefer games where there's no spooky horror model coming at you and you just kind of are incentivized to run to safety as soon as possible if there is a model kind of glad that i didn't see it i'm a little tempted to go back and see if there is but i think it's better to not no, like it creates this kind of haunting horror verse, you know, maybe if I was taken out of the moment by seeing a model that is kind of silly. Yeah, I like it. I don't really have any notes. I think it's a good little experience. The sound design is good. I like the differing footsteps upstairs, downstairs. Picking things up sounds good. The whispering was the right volume. The spooky breath of the creature was good. Yeah, I liked it. Even the notes are, you know, simple, silly, short, but I like them. No notes. I like it. Thank you for making the game. That's been it for this video. If you liked it, please leave comments for the developer on the issue page or here. If they check it out, I'm sure they would love to know your thoughts. Alright, I'll see you in the next video. Bye bye.